Normally this heavy weight runs smoothly. However, this Actros is having problems shifting gears. The sensor of the gear module is defective and must be replaced. To do so, remove the gear module. Start your work by removing the gear module connector. Then undo the airline. This is tricky because it is difficult to access. Once the airline is free, continue with the screws. There are six in total. Unscrew them and take the gear module from its position. For the next steps, you'll need the new parts kit. This includes the new gear sensor, a cap, a connector frame, 11 screws, two O-rings, and two seals with special lubrication. First, remove the connector frame. To do this, undo 11 screws and take off the frame. Undo the two screws on the cap. Then unclip it with a suitable tool. Now you can access the speed sensor. Now remove the gasket from the old connector frame. This may not be reused. Now start with the installation of the new gear sensor. What's new? The contacts are already greased. This special grease is important because it prevents the formation of corrosion. Place an O-ring on the sensor. Cover it with the grease from the parts kit. Then insert the new gear sensor. Make sure of the correct installation position. Not like this, but like this, the notch on the gear sensor must be towards the connector frame. Unclip the two solenoid valves from their position and then disconnect the intermediate plate. The solenoid valves and intermediate plate are installed on the new connector frame. Place one of the two seals in the housing. Coat it with lubricant. Then you can put your old intermediate plate into the new connector frames. Do the same with the solenoid valves. Place the second gasket on the gear module housing and lubricate it. Likewise, smear the heads of the solenoid valves with grease. Then install the new connector frame into the gear module housing. Then tighten the 11 new screws with a torque of 10 newton meters. Check as you work. As you work, check whether the sensor plug has moved. If it is still positioned in the correct position, you can proceed. The new cap is next. Push back the remaining O-ring and smear it with lubricant. 
then mount the cover on the gear module housing. Before you reinstall, double check the air vent. Does it look old? Then replace it. The kit contains the red rubber sleeve, the breather cap with bracket and sealing washer. After removing the old vent, put the new washer and the new bracket and install both onto the gear module. Then place the cover into the rubber grommet and push until both click into the bracket. Now you need to clean the surface of the gear module housing thoroughly. Because this is the only way that the sealant will stick properly. Use the gun to neatly apply sealant to the surfaces. Then you can return the gear module with the new sensor to its place. Once you have taught in the gear, take a short test drive. And does the gear work properly? Stop. Then the work has been worthwhile.